Hey everyone, welcome to Tea Time with Gretchen. In today's video, I will be creating a Willy Wonka the Chocolate Factory Tea Party. If you are my returning friends and subscribers, thank you so much for always being here and watching my videos. And if you are new to this channel, welcome. I hope you will enjoy uh, my contents. So for this tea party, I chose um, my dining room for this one in, in my dining table and I created um, the three tier is going to be the centerpiece and I just decorated the three tier with like a garden like uh, chocolate factor in it and I made like a hat actually my daughter made that hat for me and she painted it red and I just uh, paint a little bit of purple on the side of it and then I also made that board that says Wonka the chocolate factory it's a um, chalkboard and I just uh, wrote in it and then I added like some uh, candy cane uh, the candy lollipop there that was the swirl um, lollipop I got those from Dollar Tree and then as well as the um, the mushroom house I wish I um, I had more mushrooms but I couldn't find any so I just went ahead and grabbed just one that was enough so yeah and then I also um, um, decorated the teapot that I got um, I got like the polka dotted teapot I just um, added like the pom-poms that I got from Dollar Tree as well is a colorful pom-pom so I just um, went ahead and uh, throw all of the colors in there um, if you've seen the movie um, Wonka the Chocolate Factory they have a feel of whimsical just like how the Alice and Wonderland is so yes and for this so yeah that three tier is going to be the centerpiece right there and that's where I'm going to add the, the desserts and then I have the teapot right there and then I have uh, the apothecary jar that I will be filling up with some chocolates and then I have another cute um, chocolate holder right there that I will be filling up with some chocolate nuts as well. So for our desserts and goodies, we had mostly chocolates. On this first plate, I placed the chocolate truffles that came from Aldi. And on the glass container right there on the side, I added some dark chocolate with almonds. And then on the apothecary jar, I added some, some individually wrapped chocolates. And on the second tray, I will be adding some fresh strawberries and strawberries that has been coated with some chocolates. And then on the very bottom tray, I'm going to add a chocolate pudding that I made. And then if you've noticed as well, I added some chocolate bars that is that has a purple wrapper, which really went well with um, the theme color for these Wonka the Chocolate Factory.
is my Wonka the Chocolate Factory inspired chocolate tea party. I hope you guys like this. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. And please, if you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel with an all the notification so you'll always be updated every time I upload a new one. And give this a huge big thumbs up and as well as share this to your family and friends. Thank you! So I hope you guys had fun watching me putting this uh, chocolate tea party together. This was so much fun to do and we will definitely do this again and again because we really enjoy the um, chocolates and just um, eating them together and drinking the hot chocolate together. So yes. I hope you guys were inspired to do this as well for your afternoon tea, you know, to make it special. And yeah, thank you, thank you so much for being here. This is Tea Time with Gretchen. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!